Yes. When our next guest was a teen, she made her society debut at the Waldorf Astoria, Very I might impressive. add. And shortly thereafter, traded in her white gloves to be closer to the catcher's mitt. You believe mm. that? So please, say hello to one of the very few women striking them out today, minor league baseball umpire, Perry Barber. <laughs> oh, coming in here, they lied to us. Perry! Hi! <laughs> Can I help you in some way? Yeah. I mean, are you under there? Okay, here. this guy, obviously, is all the stuff that do you yeah. wear all this. Oh, yeah, sure you do, do, right? I've gotten yeah. my collarbone broken, ribs broken, legs bruised, and the reason you wear all this is to prevent that from happening. Are you sure we should be doing Just this can't segment? Wait, to get into the segment? Wait a minute. Just can't Sit wait down, to get Perry. into the segment. Sit down. Let us talk to you for a second. Now, tell us. Here you were, this nice, sweet thing, came out at the Waldorf Astoria, and now you are an umpire. How did it happen? Whatever possessed you to become that? It was almost a mistake. <laughs> Why? Um, I got interested in baseball more as a trivia category than as a game to go to, to watch, to participate in. Right. I had never played it, never been interested until about seven years ago and I started reading about it and in the course of reading about baseball and learning about the history and the lore, I read a book about umpires and decided during the baseball strike in 1981 to umpire in a little league just to have something really? to do with baseball. Right. And I discovered that I loved it even though I was atrocious. Were you? Oh, I was terrible. It's a lot more difficult than people I realize. Bet. And if you don't have training, it is tough. Yeah. <laughs> so where do you go to get training? How do you learn how to become a, an umpire and you're not umpiring in the minor There are three accredited umpire schools in the mm. United States. Two of them are in Florida. One of them is right here in New York at the Fordham University campus. Right. And to get a job in the minors, you have to place high enough in the class to be assigned to a league. And you work your way up through the farm system the same way as the ball players do. You spend years and years calling them in the bushes. There you and are. There's a picture of that. Close up of you. Yeah, that was in Utah in a minor league in 1983. Right. right. And What's that, this? Uh, that's in spring training <gasps> with a the Mets, Mets farm club. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Mets. That's my team. Yeah. That's my team. Yeah. Good team. Now, you're the only team. lady who has done that um, in the, with the Mets in spring training? Yes, with the Mets, yes. Yeah. There's another lady out who works spring training out in Arizona who's in the uh, in, uh, American Association, right. which is a triple A league. Right. And what happened the first time you, you came out on the field with these guys? With the Mets or yeah, the any Mets. guys? Here you are, spring training with the Mets. Um, nothing. They don't, you they mean you're they, odd are you telling me they never said one thing to you the, the first time you called a strike? Um, Hard to believe. Gary Carter did, but he says... <gasps> did every, he, what did he say? He, he turned around and announced to the crowd, well, the reason she called out a strike on me was because I wouldn't go out with her two years ago. <gasps> <laughs> Is that true? And you know what I said? <laughs> Is that true? Oh, I care about right it. Away, so right I turned away. right around and I announced to the crowd, well, you know as well as I do that the reason I called that strike on you was because you did. <laughs> because he did yeah. ask you out? Oh. No, but he didn't really. We were he just didn't. having you were yeah. just teasing. Yeah. Just having a generally yeah. good time. Yes. Yeah. Are they tough, around. these guys? Do um, they scream at you? The, the more professional the level of baseball, right. the less likely they are to yell at the umpires. It's mm -hmm. generally in the lower minors and in amateur baseball, particularly in high school, and Little League, where you get the idiots, the jerks, acting like children. She said that, not me. Have you ever heard of that? I did not say that. I did not. Have you, in fact, ever gone out with the, some of the players? You're very attractive. I'm sure they have asked you out. No. Never? No. To tell you the truth, I don't get asked that often because, for one thing, I don't usually look that good. I'm wearing a little makeup Aww. now, but <laughs> with sweet. sweat running down my yeah. face and yeah. me yelling yeah. strike three, he's out, they don't want to ask me out for a beer. After but how about <laughs> <laughs> Not even with those 8 by 10s you passed around with you in the evening uh, We now. saw them at the evening <laughs> That's right, we I'll did. tell you what, a few times I run into ball players in my street clothes. They do not there you are. recognize There you are indeed. They do not recognize me. And look this at was when this you made guy. your debut? Yes. With my oh, look at one. you. How sweet. That must seem like uh, another lifetime. It, it really is. I'll tell yeah. you, umpiring changed me. How? It really has. <laughs> <laughs> How? In what way? Yeah. It, um, 
it allowed me to realize for the first time in my life that it was much more important to gain respect from people than to have them like you. Because if you're out there umpiring game and you're worrying about, oh my God, if I call this guy out, he's not going to be nice to me the next time I talk to him. Yeah. You're not going to last at all. You've got to go out there and do your job and just worry about doing your job, and that's it. Great. All right, Speaking Perry. of doing your job, right? Show us what oh we have boy. to do. I'm going to be the catcher. You're going to be the umpire. I'm playing the part of the umpire. Right. Today's right. performance. Right. Yes, you the are. Part of Tomorrow the umpire. you get to be the catcher. Be I by. get to be right. the Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay. Now, this is, I'm the catcher, so I get to wear this? Yes. yes. I insist on catchers wearing their equipment properly. A lot of times I see them wearing it improperly. I, I have bet. to teach them how to get dressed. Well, you're supposed to wear a hat. That with the sunglasses, that. trust yeah. me. You're a killer. You're a killer. There's only one problem with this. How do you ever call anything? Because you, you can't talk in this show. Well, the only thing you do is call the pitches. Every time uh -huh. the ball is batted, you take the mask off. That's oh, your first instinctive oh. reaction. Okay. Well, it's right. a lot easier if you okay. do this with the mask. Yeah. The mask is generally the last thing that goes on. Oh, oh. <laughs> well, we have our own way here. I hope so. We have our own way here at Attitude. Yes. Be careful. Okay. I could fall and kill myself. Okay. Here. I All want right. you to know you're All putting right. on a major league chest protector here too. I Whoa. borrowed this from Ed Montague, who's not right. firing out at Shea Stadium. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, All right. So All this right. is the catcher's now, gear. Go ahead. You okay. dress. Mary. All right. Okay, now, All right. Let me shin guards just... go yeah. on with okay. the buckles on the outside, right. so I'll when you run... Boy, I'm enjoying this. Up. I really am. Right. Like, I'm enjoying Mary. this segment. Stop into something, No, I, I just stand I don't know. I'm fluffing up. All How right. do I look? <laughs> go ahead. Strike. Yeah. Strike. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> okay, I feel really good. This is going just the way it should. Here we go. You're on. I'm the pretty one. All right. Now, get her dress, and let's go... Chuck some balls. Okay, what here. do I uh, here? Do I wear this? Slap thing? on here. Uh, you Perry. slap on everything. <laughs> they will. I don't think slap you on. Slap <laughs> well, no. Okay. Take, take the mask off. Okay. And hurry, it says. Hurry. And you have to hurry. Put hurry. Put your hat on like this. Okay. Where's Ron Stay Darling on, when you really need him? You know what I'm saying? All right. Okay, now go ahead. My hat might be a little small. Yeah, it's a little small for me, but oh, that's, that's okay. Why. I'll make Should it. Should I just uh, slap All this right. on here? Here I go, kids. Wait. <laughs> I'm having a small problem, but let's not panic. Okay, okay. here I go. I'm going over here to home plate. Here, oh, my mitt. Yes, I'm a catcher, right. <laughs> catchers, uh, catchers need mitts. Yeah, oh, the, pardon me? Throw you the mitt. Here you go, gay. My producer is now going to pitch me some of these balls. Uh, this ought to be good. We probably won't. Right. Now, wait a minute. I've got to get my nails into this. Shin guards. Serious stuff. Yeah, forget about that. Because we just want to get into this, right? All right, but only because yeah. it's a demonstration. Yeah. Yeah. Catchers okay. and umpires Listen, should when always I, when wear When I really shoes. umpire, I'll have mine. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now, Perry. All right, now what uh, about this? I don't know about uh, you guys, but I'm also. having real trouble with okay. <laughs> okay. All right, here I go. Always make sure right. your, your earrings yeah. go with your ears. Uh, okay. You're, you're really looking hot, <laughs> my bracelet. Now what? Now, now, thank you, you so much. The, okay. I'm the umpire. Okay. Okay. Huh? That's the mine. Oh, oh, yeah. You can oh, tell. The oh, maniac oh, is here. Oh, yeah, of course you're gay. Catchers usually position themselves in what's called the catcher's box, which is right about here. That and far, huh? Yeah, yes. Okay. Yes. And okay. you crouch down like this. Right. That's why I have pants on. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Don't throw the ball yet. Don't okay. throw the ball yet, for God's sake. No. <laughs> Don't throw the ball yet. <laughs> Trust me on this one, okay? okay. Now, now what? The umpire. Okay. Now the um, other princess. <laughs> <laughs> what a macho segment. I feel like I've just had a root right. canal. No, no, no. Oh, my God. Okay, no. ready? I don't know. Wait, are you ready? No, okay. no, no, she's not. I have All to right. teach okay, her how to stand. This is okay. my favorite part, getting close to those cute catchers. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. So, Ooh. Watch Ooh. yourself at all watch times. It. That's ready? as close as I get. Oh, there we go. Now no, 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 wait. Okay, <laughs> now, your stance is like this, with this foot even with her foot, okay, the back move. foot behind him. This is so you're protected. You let the catcher <laughs> get hit. Okay? You let anything, any wounds that will happen occur to the catcher, oh. not to you. See, I understood that instinctively. <laughs> yes, okay. And you get down like this. Okay, okay ready? Here she goes. Level with her head, leaning forward, 
quit. Oh, my God. That was the wrongest I ever saw. <laughs> Okay, wait. When okay. she throws the ball, watch the pitch all the way into her glove. Then you stand right up there, and make your call. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Another ball. Another ball. If it's a ball, another ball. Is anybody on base? <laughs> Let's get into a new sport. Okay. If it's a ball, you stay down like okay. this. Right. Called. Okay. Ball. 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 Loud. Ball. Loud. Oh, it's a ball. <laughs> You're going to show me now. I'll Try to hand over the plate, big okay. guy. Perry's going to okay. demonstrate how this should happen. One ball and one <laughs> strike, all right? Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Ready? Go ahead, Perry. Perry. Oh, yeah. Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. Come on, Dave. Put a little okay. smoke on it. when we return. Now go away. brings the other woman out of the shadows with a week of passionate movies. The mystique of the lady from yesterday. How did you find me? The fire of passions. You are filth. The betrayal of the other woman. How dare you make a move on my husband? The bitterness of when your lover leaves and the heartache of another woman's child. You want to be my mother. Well, you're not. It's five seductive movies starring the other woman. All this week at 4 p.m., 3 central, only on Lifetime. A cheese riddle. Hey, Mom, what do you get when you add melted cheddar cheese to ordinary broccoli? Oh. Oohs and ahs. Yes, cheese makes it taste better. So don't forget the cheese. Don't you touch these crescents, Grandpa. Pillsbury Crescents. Nothing makes a meal more special. 